up. Right here. Tell them what you were doing. Burning out racing through my neighborhood. Burning out racing through after my after I told neighborhood. you not to. I'm not in your face. Get out of my neighborhood. Burning out racing through my neighborhood. Burning out racing through my neighborhood. I told you not to. I'm not in your face. Get out of my neighborhood. At any point, are you thinking about what happened to Trayvon Martin? Us living in Sanford, which is the same place where Trayvon Martin got shot. Uh, and that incident was actually like five to 10 minutes away from where he uh, was killed. Um, I've always, like my parents have always uh, taught me about things like this, situations like this. I learned from seeing situations like these that a phone can either save your life or um, they could have gotten away with what they did if I wasn't recording. So you know these two men were arrested. Uh, what, are your, what are your feelings about the fact that this, blew up over you all being in their neighborhood and were you were you speeding or something was that was that pretty much it and if you were you know that's that doesn't justify the response obviously i was speeding a little bit but um like you said i don't think he should have took it upon himself to do something about that i think he should have just called the police and let them deal with that i was disgusted i couldn't believe what i was seeing i couldn't believe this was happening to my son um, it was just, it was horrifying. I, I can't say anything else besides it. I was terrified and, and thanking God that nothing happened to my son. Do you believe this was racially motivated or that his skin color played uh, a part in why he was treated this way? There's no doubt in my mind that had he been white or of another color that this would not have happened to him. This was definitely racially motivated. They were so upset. You can see in the video that they were angry. They were so upset telling him to get out of their neighborhood. He doesn't belong there. Who are they? They don't own neighborhoods. Who are they? What do they mean? It had to be his skin color. I say, you know, if you ever get to the situation, you stay calm, you videotape, you turn your phone on. If something happened to you, we have evidence. You know, to stay calm, just don't escalate it. It shows that it shows that he was more calmer than the adult. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.